Turning now to a story you will only see on nine. Concerned families contacted nine on your side about conditions at a Farmville cemetery. We've stayed on top of this story for more than a year, and today the issue made it to a judge in Pitt County. Our Carrigan was inside the courtroom and has the latest. Concerned families at Crestlawn Memorial Gardens received what they considered good news here in court today. For more than a year, these community members have been working to get their concerns heard. Issues which got the attention of the North Carolina Cemetery Commission in Raleigh. Monday, both the Cemetery Commission and the owner of the cemetery, Timothy Watson, agreed to put the facility in receivership. Community members tell me they were happy with the outcome. I was glad to hear that a decision is being made that uh, there will be uh, a receiver put in place. We think this is a step forward in what we we're asking for. So we're on the right track and we would not be here if it wasn't for Channel 9. Now someone appointed by the commission will act as a manager at Crest Lawn. The attorney with the commission told me the person put in charge will go through the financial records and update audits. They will also work to get community members items they paid for but have yet to receive. Timothy Watson's attorney told me Watson did not want to talk on camera, but he did have this to say on his behalf. It is highly unlikely he will continue in ownership over the long term. A receivership is simply there to make sure that things are handled orderly. It doesn't take his property from him. His goal is to make sure everyone is repaid, getting exactly what they bargained for, and making sure their loved ones are at peace. Now the commission will find someone to buy the cemetery in the future. Caragan 9 on your side.